Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim! I'm Kamchak Fisco. Come and join me for an epic adventure! In the main house, look for the bee statue. Got it. Um, Where's this Thieves Guild book thing? Uh, anybody remember the name of the damn book I just picked up? It's like the guide to being a better thieves guild, or a better thief or some shit. I'm pretty sure I looked thoroughly. Alright, once again, just looking at the eyeballs, trying to go quickly through all this. And guide to being a better, th to better thieving. Oh, it's a, it's a regular book. It's not actually... Okay, it's just a regular book. So, I've already read it before. That's why it was already marked as read. Makes sense. I'm assuming that goes into the house, or at least the courtyard. Alright, so I'm probably going to want, like, uh, invisibility potions hotlisted. Because we do not want to get caught. That's not the... Uh, yeah, we have it on the sneaking one. Do I not have invisibility as one of the hotlisted ones? Well, that's a problem. Let's uh, go to do that right now. Because that would be important. Potion of... Nope, 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 nope. Nope. Uh, nope. Not one of those. There's the big parking, elixir, cure disease, fortify, visibility. Here we go. Let's go through the crappy ones first. Uh, do I have regular invisibility potions? I think I've already used all the other ones. So I might have to make some more visibility potions because I don't think I have that one. Oh, here we go. Prolonged invisibility. That's actually shorter than the fancy ones I can make. I'll drink a harder to detect. Alright, so all those are done. We'll slam an invisibility right now. So we're at least invisible for the next 30-something seconds. Probably would have been smarter to wait until night. Golden Glow Estate. Going inside isn't an act of interacting the pulls you to invisibility, is it? Oh, she actually left it. Vacuum up the whole damn house. This is shit not flagged as quote-unquote stealable. So this is just loose shit in the house that's not considered stealing. Good lord, that's a lot of stuff. And then we gotta burn the thing down when we're done. Interesting. You'd think there would be, like, you know, somebody in here somewhere. I guess they're all outside during the day. Whoops, that was already empty. I actually wonder if I would have already picked up the bee statue, honestly. I would think it would be flagged as something important so we wouldn't just auto-do that. But I don't know exactly how the code for the pickup works. That's an expert to go outside. Wasn't this just another door to the main room? It's further up than I meant to go, but apparently that was the right spot. Well, that cloth just came flying at me. Damn near took my head off, too. Just minding my own business. Flying dish rags, trying to kill people. Scary. Okay.
What else here? Like a lot of end tables. Like a lot of end tables. I want to go back and see what this one door was. It's got to be like another little closet like that one we just opened. I honestly thought it led to where we saw that giant um, barrel. But obviously that wouldn't have made any sense where we would have seen it. Strong box. Mm, nope, nope, nope. A little bit more. Just a hair. There we go. Nope, that's just gold. Empty sack. Assuming the bee statue's either upstairs or, uh, once again, we've already picked it up. I wish we could actually get the pickup mod to work on line of sight, because there is a mode for that, but the problem is, is it's so moody about line of sight that it's real easy to not pick something up that you can literally see is right in front of you and isn't hidden by any kind of barricade. That's why you kind of have to do the area effect one. Which sucks, but it's that or don't have it at all. Kind of stupid. Do it, hi! Well, there's somebody in the house. So there's, there's that. Anything else in the... Well, there's another end table. I might as well look. Oh, oh it's empty. But. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure there's a but. There's always a but. Can you get over the... Quit getting hung up on the deer head. Auto save. It's always jarring. It's that momentary panic. Well, this is the cellar. This isn't the way up, it's the way down. Okay, grab what's in here. You don't see shit, buddy. I'm invisible. Oh, wow, the second floor is like a whole thing. Okay, let me finish exploring this then. Well, aren't you the master of the house? No, you're just the guards. This is ballsy and really, really stupid. Where's the, the potion invisibility shit? Let's pop one of those so I'm invisible. <laughs> this invalidates it. I'm going to pop another one before I walk back out, just to be sure. We have plenty, so I'm not worried about it. Mm hmm. I don't know if I got all the others over here, but I'm going to check. Yeah, because this just went outside. So, I'm going up first, because the quest wants us to go down. Actually, it wants us to go both ways. Well, okay. I didn't realize there was a waypoint up here. It is always so jarring. You walk into a room and just suck everything up that's not nailed down. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a note. Uh, got ingredients in here? Yes. Sometimes we do, sometimes we don't. It's always best to check. So far, so good. We seem to be... Sorry I'm being quiet. When I'm doing stealthy sequences, I tend to suddenly get quiet. Like somehow, my noise level will affect anything in-game. It's not remotely rational, but it's how my brain works. Alright, you're just standing there chilling. There are quite a few guards here. She said eight, and I've, I've already counted, what, six? Five or six? 
full. Uh, what now? Got it. It's in his actual bedroom. I mean, that makes sense. Okay. Whoops. Didn't mean to search that. It's empty. Is there anything worth stealing? Wow, quite a bit. All right, I'm going to back out and save before we rob him, because sometimes pickpocketing goes awry. I'll take your safe key. That'll make life a lot easier. I will take your weapons, too, if I can. I'll leave you your clothes. For now. All right, well, that's done. I'm assuming the safe is in the basement. The the bee statue, they I don't remember anybody saying shit about getting a bee statue. Was I did I miss the conversation that told me to grab it or is it just there's spare loot if you find it? Let's get the hell out of here. Well, not the hell out of here, but let's get back to uh, ground floor. So it's not something they'll tell us about. It's just if we find it, we get the bonus. Unless it's some big fancy side quest kind of thing. Do I want to go out of my way to do these bonus quests before I head back to the Thieves Guild, just to make it easier. Is it, like, critical that they be grouped up with the missions as I go through the arc? Auto save. And there's sacks everywhere. Like the, not the racketeering, what the hell are we doing? The shill one and the other one. No, but I'm, I'm, I'm talking about the other side jobs that, they, that the other two gave us. Is it worth just like doing all in one swoop, then go back, then get two more of those as well as the next main one? Just try to make it go a little faster or something like that? Well, hi, boys. That better not be the chest. Okay, yeah, that's what I thought. It makes more sense that way. Like the whole, well, you were out, so you should have just done this. I want to get into that chest. I really do. Why does this place look like nobody's touched it in decades? Uh, okay. Interesting storage room you have here. This seems, uh, not so normal. I'm gonna take a potion if I'm gonna zip past this dude. I feel a little more confident now. I'm guessing this is another way out of here. Really wonder what was in that chest the two guards were sitting right next to. 
And I've counted like 10 or so guards. That's more than the eight she was talking about. Gold and the bill of sale. Ooh. We can steal the property out from under him. Holy shit. Wait, wasn't I in the sewer? How did I not see this entrance? Is this a different sewer section? Whoops. Don't unsneak, stupid. Oh, it drops into the section I was in. Okay. Although we do need to come out here because we need to get back up and be able to get to the field so we can burn them. All oh, without anybody knowing we were ever here. Alright, that'll give us about 50 seconds. Sword away. We're not here to kill anybody. Okay, where are these beehives? I'm assuming it's these over here. And then when we're done with this, we can zip over to wherever the next subquest is. I, um... Exactly... What, am I supposed to use a fireball spell? How does light on fire? Put, put that away. That's not exactly stealthy, though. Is there a stealthy way to light this shit on fire? Okay. Fire spell it is. Got it. No more than three. And go back to the falchion. Put it away. Grab the nern root that's over here. All right, so we are going to. Where were these side quests? Plant the stolen granite in Heimskar's house. That's one of them. Wait, where's the... Okay, there should be another side quest. Well, let's go to Bree's home. It's our house. Since we're here. It's been a while since we've been there. As long as the game doesn't crash... I need to remember to do some cooking, cooking in Bree's home because it has a unique stove that makes other food recipes that aren't on the regular cooking pot. Game. Game. Um. It's frozen for me, but it's not frozen for you guys. Good. Okay. That was really odd. For you guys and on OBS, you're seeing the animation with the smoke rising in real time. For me, it was frozen. That was trippy. I've never seen that before. Where what I see is not what's actually being recorded. Did, is this still... Hey, I don't catch fire when I run where the fireplace used to be. They finally fixed that. Ooh, a whole bunch of nightshade. Cool. Alright, what was I, I was gonna... Well, aside from the oven, because I just wanted to check really quick. Yeah, we do the dumplings. Pie, braided bed, garlic bread. And what was the garlic one? Cures all diseases. That's why I like making this stuff. Okay, and then the rest of these 
make potato bread. Uh, this increased capacity, bows do more damage. Apple dumplings are actually really, really handy. Okay, but that's not why we're here. Um, can I make some churn butter? Cool. Uh, we need to do something in town. I also need to check my missions and see what this other one that's not being tracked is, because I couldn't find it on the map. Okay. Return to Brynhoff. Boxed artifact. That was the one about the kill of thieves, so that's got to be a downloaded one, because even Janie didn't recognize it. Was it a side quest? Queen Bee statue. Return to Morwen in the Skull Village. Wait, where's the numbers one? Plant the stolen garnet. Right. No. St wait. Numbers job. There it is. Freaking hell. Oh, it's also in White Run. Perfect. Okay, so they're both in White Run. Well, that makes this easier. One's here. Oh, you mean every single time it crashed, you guys saw the animation going where it was frozen for me? That's kind of funny. It's. Is it in here? I didn't mean to go outside the bucket, damn it. Well, they're actually the main quests. So that's why I was surprised, because I looked into the side quests and they were. Or, no, side quests, not you're right. Side quests, not miscellaneous quests. Duh, the different things. I knew that. I, I just forgot, but I knew that. Wait, where's the... Oh, it's upstairs. I'm stupid. Don't mind me, lady. I'm just going to go through and... Uh, I guess mess with your numbers. Forge business numbers. Yep, okay, there we go. Hi, how's it going? Don't worry, I'm not up to anything nefarious anymore. Alright, there were two other quests while I was here. Since we've already done everything in Whiterun, I'm going to guess their side quest because they couldn't be anything else. Oh, one isn't here. It's just leading me out of town. My bread? I'm sure where did they do the step? Just recently. Oh, that's handy. At least you don't have to deal with a headache. That's totally out of the way for you. That'll help a lot. Sorry about that, gang. Taking a drink. Ooh, what other fancy stuff can we steal? Uh, that's enough. All right. We needed to plant something here. Well, let's take what he has. The Stop drawing your sword, dude. Is it going to be a miscellaneous item? Oh, shit. Why am I asking you guys? I should just check this stupid thing. Stolen Garnet. Right. I'm asking you guys what it says on my screen that I can look up myself because I'm stupid. Is it just going to be a Garnet or is it going to be a stolen Garnet specifically? I'm guessing it's going to be the stolen Garnet. Yep, stolen garnet. Ta-da! Put that away before you fall on your sword, dumbass. Alright, so those are done. And what does the Empire do? So, both at the same time. Done, done. Go to the Dwarven Museum in Markarth and kill the thief. I guess we might as well do that one while we're out here. Although, if that's actually a modded quest... That's going to be like a... That could very well be a whole thing. Kill the thief. That's not the museum. That's the Understone Key. You know what? I'm going to wait and do that later. I'm going to wait and do that later. I don't trust that that's not going to lead to some big arc that we don't want to start yet. I want to try to get through the Thieves' Guild. Then move on to the next guild. And if we have any like little side things here that are mod-related, we can go back and do them later. 
Was that really necessary, sir? Just bust the axe out all intimidating like? Uh, eventually. It, it's not like immediately on the docket. Um, it would be something that we'd probably be doing sometime down the road after we're done with the Dead Risings. It's not one I had immediately... I mean, it's one I want to do, but it's not one I had immediately planned anytime soon. Okay, so this leads out, right, we go across, and then it goes down to the bar. Haha. -ha. So I'm going to talk to her first, then him, then the actual mission dude. And I guess the bonus objectives are always going to go to... Him? Or so, is it going to matter? What can I do for you today? Can I sell this bee, Queen Bee statue to Well, you? well. I was looking for this little beauty. If you happen to cross any other unusual trinkets like this, be sure to bring them to me. I promise it'll be worth the effort. There you go. This should cover it. Yeah, from what I've heard, it's its own campaign, and it's really not that good compared to the main game. I've completed the numbers, If job. you don't watch it, I may actually start to respect you. Job well done. Thank you. Ready for some extra work. Great. What you want to do? Uh, there's like a limited number of these, right, Stumpy? This business is a regular target for the guild. I keep pretty shoddy records, so the job should be a cinch. You in? Sure. Nice. Yeah. This is what you need to know. Numbers job. Let's make sure it's actually tracked. More white run stuff, which makes sense. We're going to be doing towns at a time. Steal anything worth talking about? Completed the chill job. Um, I've completed Didn't muck it up, I hear. Good. Here's your share. I'm ready for some more work. Good. We could use the coin. I guess I'll go through each category until I finish them, because I would just have to imagine there's a limited number of jobs. I don't see this being a uh, roguelike for the quests. This one should be easy. Get in, plant the goods, and get out. Quiet and neat. Sound like your kind of job? Sure. All so right. Done. Take this and get out of here. I'm assuming white run again. Yep, still more white run stuff, because I imagine each one is related to a city. Right, we gotta go through here. And to the cistern. Alright, dude, your shit's done. So we'll be popping by Whiterun pretty much after every job until we've taken over the town. Raffian quests are infinite, but at least do have bonuses after so many. Okay. But I assume I need to do so many before we've unlocked a town to be available, yes? I, I, I guess I talked to you. It's, why is there a quest over there? My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. I really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoyed them. So you all take care of yourselves, and if you want to see more of me, queue up the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below. Please remember to take that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.